Whoa, check that out. You guys actually did it. You guys helped me get to 100,000 subscribers. That's 100,000 new OGs that subscribe to the channel. Now I have a new challenge for you. I'm trying to get to 250,000 subscribers, so be sure to hit the like button on this video, subscribe if you haven't, and click that post notification bell for daily videos and weekly live streams. Now I gotta go. Hope you guys enjoyed this video. What is going on guys? It is your boy T Stingray and welcome back to another Driving Empire video, baby. Today we are going to be buying a supercar. Yes, another one. Of course, T Pro, you're always buying supercar. What did I just drop? <laughs> so today, guys, we are buying one of the new cars that was added in Driving Empire. But before we get started with this video, guys, be sure to super smack that thumbs up button. Subscribe if you guys haven't. And don't forget to click that post notification bell for more, guys. And also, go make sure you guys subscribe to my girlfriend's channel. Her link is down in the description down below. Go check her out. She posts awesome Roblox videos. Not car ones, because you guys are probably tired of me probably tired of t pro so you if you guys want to watch regular gameplays go check out my girlfriend's channel she posts awesome gameplays as well like i do but here we go let's get in this gameplay guys today we are in here by bayside motors i don't know whose car this is what is this okay that's an old c i think that's an old corvette right there here we go let's go get this car guys all right right here let's go to new vehicles and there it is our very brand new Ferrari. If you guys have gotten this, let me know in the comments down below. This is the 2022 F8 Tributo. Yes. I want to say that the model is kind of like confusing in a way because it kind of is missing a little bit of, you know, F8 Tributo kind of. <laughs> like it doesn't have the shark fin looking. It does. I see it, but it's kind of in too much. But this is a pretty cool model, guys. I mean, it's 200 and twelve thousand dollars it's got the ferrari red on it but we gotta change the rims my boy what is up with these rims yes there we go the black rims with the yellow caliper i'm buying it let's go now let's go ahead and test this out in the track and also at the highway race guys if you guys haven't checked out me buying the brand new zonda r go check it out right now the video is going to be in my channel if you guys haven't seen it but let's go check out this brand new ferrari right here the tributo this is going to be an awesome car let's see where it's at here we go the 2022 oh yes that sounds so nice and look at that that looks cool i'm not gonna lie that does look pretty cool looks like a shark to me what do you guys think does that look like a shark because that looks like a like a uh, baby shark to me in a way <laughs> but here we go oh i like that it sounds a lot different than the other cars oh my gosh oh the handling is absolutely amazing oh oh we just did a flip we just did a flip it's a real wheel drive as well okay there we go we were doing a drift oh the handling is nice but you know what? i need to test this out at the highway race first guys because that's what we gotta do we gotta test the speed first before we taste test the handling so let's get it all right here we go guys we're gonna go ahead and upgrade this oh gosh come on we gotta upgrade it before oh we gotta upgrade it before it starts we got seven seconds we need to upgrade the engine go 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 why didn't i do this before <laughs> come on come on oh gosh oh okay i think we still have time we have a little bit when the countdown is going down okay boom come on we got the twin turbo why okay boom come on there we go we got to equip what else do we need uh, all wheel drive most important thing oh gosh four seconds left premium boost oh gosh go oh let's go i think we made it just in time i'm not sure what other upgrade we missed oh my goodness but that bugatti is gone okay i'm trying to catch up to this 765 lt oh wow 238 miles per hour that's it that's my max speed okay 280 okay with the boost it's around 280 not bad i mean it's not it's not the fastest but it's not bad it, it does stay pretty uh pretty still on the track though i like the uh the rigidness of this car but it's slow it's a slow ferrari it does look cool though but it's a slow ferrari we can't catch up at all <laughs> 
but you know what it does look cool i'm gonna keep it for the collection and i don't think it's as fast as the sf90 stradale but here we go boom we just finished it wow slow car slow car was there any upgrade that we missed maybe that's why the brakes okay we didn't really need the brakes well but let's go ahead and buy it the insane grip tires i guess i mean we didn't really need that we got everything else so nothing really helped us <laughs> nothing really helped us so it's not the fastest it doesn't go over 300 which is kind of reasonable the interior is needs it needs a little work <laughs> needs a little work uh but overall this car is pretty cool if you guys want a uh super cheap uh super car this is one uh this is one for the books right here oh gosh come on but it only goes up to like 280 i think come on come on come on 270 280 it's like 281 282 not bad at all all right let's go to the let's go to the highway race or the around the city race and maybe we can do something better there all right here we go this is it guys this is the challenge i usually win this a lot especially with like slow cars because it's not about being fast on this race it's about being the best in handling and of course being a t pro uh, like me but uh let's see if we can win this one the 765 lt oh my gosh what did i just do i feel like i can still catch up i can still catch up even though i messed up your boy is still a pro the zr1 and the 765 lt is in front of me right now that's like my biggest competitors oh gosh but i'm gonna win this one watch this guys Oh, look at that. Oh, yes. Did you guys see that? I was smooth. But you know what? I got to catch up to my boy up there with the 765 LT. He thinks he is slick, my boy. Oh, gosh. I thought I was slick. And I flipped over now. Okay, come on. We got to win this one. I know I got to catch up. I am not about to lose to a freaking McLaren. All right, let's go. Boom. He's up there, but I feel like he's gonna mess up somewhere here. I know he will. I messed up. Oh, oh, I passed him right now. Oh, wait, never mind. That was a glitch. Where'd he go? Oh, no. He did not just die in the wall. R.I.P. R.I.P. I told you. I told you. Every time, it's all about the best maneuvering one wins the whole race. And look at that. I'm gonna take my time and win this one where's the other guy at he's right over there i just won gg's i just won <laughs> oh no it was the it was someone else that lost so the 765 came in second place and the zr1 was the one that died okay so i won that race but you know what i i i'm a t pro how would you say okay you know what i got i feel like i gotta do a different race let's do a, a different one here we go we are going against the same guys again i got my my ferrari with me going against the mclaren that looks pretty dope i love the way the mclarens look the zero one looks pretty dope as well oh gosh come on this one is gonna be the race of the supercars oh gosh the handling on this is absolutely amazing and it sounds <laughs> sounds pretty cool i'm not gonna lie this car sounds pretty dope there we go come on there we go slow down slow down there we go speed up if you guys know if you guys ever been to a real racetrack you don't always like put your foot to the metal there's a lot of braking involved <laughs> there is a lot of braking i thought i missed that one. Oh gosh here we go there we go we're about to come up to first place baby and can we finish this under 80 seconds oh no we can't we can't it's impossible but i believe we can finish this under 100 if we do really good come on slow down slow down slow down there we go there we go come on boom oh we're doing super good oh my gosh your boy is a beast at this let's go t pro for the win everybody smash that thumbs up button right now because your boy is about to win this circuit race it's been a while since i did this race as well and i've i'm about to win it but can we do it under 100 seconds it looks like we are about to oh gosh there we go come on boost up boost up this is a straightaway right here that we should be going super fast at all right slow down 
There we go. Nice. <laughs> you guys heard the little back spit coming from the Ferrari as well. Here we go. We got the W, baby. And boom. 99.2 seconds. We won that super cleanly. $35,000 cash prize. The I've got to say, the handling of this is really good. It's not bad at all. It's, it's better than most cars. But it's not like fast I, I wish it was a little bit fast but uh I, I can't do anything about it maybe in the future when they have like stage two engines and like you know more upgrades more tunes maybe we can make this a uh, a really fast car but for now guys i i guess this is a really good uh you know car for circuit races not really for highway races or even i'm not even gonna try <laughs> i'm not even gonna try the uh the one fourth mile race because i feel like i'm gonna lose against uh other cars but if you guys enjoyed this video i already got a ticket my boy oh look there's a car meetup over here i think okay here we go but uh if you guys enjoyed this video and you guys want to see more be sure to smash that thumbs up button subscribe if you guys have it and there's goku oh my gosh there's goku on spawn what the heck that's so cool if you guys enjoyed this video, be sure to click that post notification bell for more guys so you guys are notified whenever I go live or post a video. But thank you guys for watching. I hope to see you guys in the next one. I'm going to park right over here and boom. I'll see you guys in the next one and peace out.